Hey, it's Julie. I think there's four things we need to thrive in veterinary medicine. So the idea is to thrive, not just survive, right? Like no one wants to just survive. We want to thrive. And in order to do that, I think there are four things that we need to really master as a skill. And I think they are all skills because I don't think we're born with any of these. So the first and foremost is we need to learn how to look for what is good. We have to take our negatively focused brain and actually deliberately and on purpose have it look for what is going well, what did go well. That's the first one. Number two, I think we need to learn how to swap our perspective. And this is a lot about choosing to think differently, understanding that the way we are currently thinking has gotten us here, but can't get us necessarily to where we want to be. So we need to learn how to think differently. And that's been a lot of what I've been teaching you, but we will still continue with that because it's probably the most important thing. Number three is about finding for ourselves social support. You get to decide what that looks like, but a lot of it is supporting each other. A lot of it is having each other's back. Not only, but it's also important to have our own back, but also about having each other's back. We know from all of the research that the more supported we feel, the more we feel that we are part of something and not alone, we are able to deal with traumatic and difficult situations better. And the fourth thing is something that we've already covered, but we never stop practicing, and that is exceptional self-care. So those are the four things that we're going to now dive into, and we're going to dive into the first three a little bit more because we've already worked a lot around self-care, but again, we always continue to. So I want you to put down below, out of those four things, which one is the hardest for you? Number one, is it looking for the good? Number two, is it swapping your perception or the way you're thinking about things? Number three, is it about supporting each other and or finding support for yourself? Or number four, is it practicing self-care? Answer, B, though. Thank you.